Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your man here, Joel Mugisha. Please, if you're not subscribed to this channel, just do the honors, man. It's so free. Hit the subscribe button and drop a like on this uh, video right here. I'm currently right now in Bujumbura. This is the capital city of Bujum Burundi, actually. One thing you have to know, guys, about Burundi is it's hot. It's really hot and humid over here. Let me show you the surroundings of where I am. So, guys, if you can see right there, behind right there, that's Lake Tanganyika, right there. I don't know if you can see from right here. Let me see if I can zoom. There is Lake Tanganyika over there. Yeah, my camera is not that good. This is where you wish you had a Samsung S23 Ultra. You could shine with it right now. <laughs> so guys, the area which I am today is is actually um I'm in Kinindo. Kinindo is uh, one of the best neighborhoods you can find in Burundi, Bujumbura. You can see the houses around me. It's really modern houses all, all over around me. You can see the house right there. Let me show you. Yeah, you can see the houses around me. It's just modern houses. This is one of the best neighborhoods Bujumbura has got to offer. So you can see right here, we got a super modern structure. I don't know how to call it, but you can see for yourself, that house is beautiful. And one thing, guys, you have to know is, people right here in Africa, they don't build with mortgages. They don't build with loans, actually. If you build a house, you build it cash. So, oh, you can see over there, somebody is building over there. It's somebody's building over there. It's actually a good, really, really good neighborhood to build your housing. So, so guys, later I'm gonna be taking a walk in this neighborhood to show you the properties and real estate in this place and uh, we're gonna enjoy let me give you a short tour of where i am this is an apartment block it has it's a two bedroom apartment block right where i am let me show you so you can see that's that right there that's the parking lot and the kids are playing we have uh, a balcony over here super modern balcony really spacious i don't know you if you guys can see really well let me show you a little bit of the inside we got the tv oh sorry we got the tv area dining area this is where the rooms are but I'm not gonna take you there some people are sleeping and we got the living room over here say hi to my viewers <laughs> that's my cousin over there she's just chilling and uh, this is basically what you can get uh, for an apartment block right here that's the outside area where we were uh, actually you can you can see the balcony better from this angle you guys can see the balcony let me take you guys to the rooftop so that you can get a 360 view of this area it's really magic so guys let's let's go to 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 the rooftop so that we can see this area right here. You wanna be on my vlog? 
That's my other cousin right here. He's Bella. Say hi to my viewers. Hi. <laughs> so I'm climbing up to the rooftop. Let's go see what is. Let's go check what is up there right now. So guys, I'm at the rooftop. You can see behind me. There is some some seating area. I'm gonna be taking you around this place. The properties in this place are just amazing right now. And I have to ask around actually how much it costs to build the house around here or to build the house around here. And, uh, yeah, let's enjoy the video. Please subscribe, guys, and drop a like on this video. Help me get to 1,000 subscribers so let's go let's enjoy coming from Lake Tanganyika. Kinindo is very close to Lake Tanganyika. So guys, I'm giving you a tour today of Kinindo, what this, uh, this city has to offer. This is one of the, I would say, as uh, Rochelle told us, it's Vietnam. Tell us your name. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Rachel. Uh -huh. I'm from Burundi. From Burundi, where are we now? We are in Kinindo. Kinindo. Kinindo city. Is Kinindo the most richest city in Bujumbura? No, it's not the most city, but it's like in medium. Okay. It's medium, medium yeah. rich. Yeah. You can find pretty good villas in this place actually to rent their what they call in French Maison de Passage which are basically like Airbnbs for renting air rentals, the people who own properties around here so you can find a little bit of everything in this place so let me take this uh, left hand because this looks better the view is better so guys remember to subscribe to this channel I'm a uh, just still a young youtuber uh, at the moment of this video I only got 100 and uh, 100 there's a car coming over here I only got about 101 subscribers so guys support me support my channel drop a like on this video hit the subscribe button and then uh, drop a comment guys uh, 
help me grow and reach 1,000 subscribers. So guys, I'm giving you a tour of this place, which is uh, Kilindo. Kilindo, one of the best. I think uh, we have a church over here. Yeah, behind me there. I'm not too good <laughs> yeah I'm not uh, I'm not that good in reading French but I can try my own way so one thing with the Burundi guys is the streets are organized every street has got a number and every house has got an address so you it's easier for you to find your own way around let me show you guys so guys uh, this is the streets this is where I'm coming from going up there to the mountains this is where I'm heading so guys you can see right here we got a number for this street it's marked and every house has got pretty much you can see over there somewhere there the street is marked so so guys I'm I'm confused I don't know if to go on my right or on my left but let me take a right and I'll know yeah this is the, this is the church guys that I saw on the other side it's one of them so this is what I'm saying every street has got a number so this is the number for this So guys over here we got a school actually this is a typical Burundian school so guys uh, I don't know if uh, we have anybody the school looks deserted because uh, the kids are in uh, holiday at the moment so I'm about to trespass right now I hope. so this is a typical Burundian public school actually this gives me memories so much memories there is the blackboard this is a typical Burundian school. So, this gives me memories, guys. This gives me memories, actually. This is the kind of benches we used to use when we were still young, actually. This is how you use it. You see it right here. Then, uh, yeah, there you can see. You see it right here. We got somewhere to keep your stuff over here. Then yeah, you can learn and follow the teacher. But I have to get out of here, guys. I think I'm trespassing. So let's continue the journey and the walk. Hit the like But We got a nice house. Look at this. This is actually a very good house to build actually it's quite a sizable house for a family looks pretty nice i like the color i don't know if that is turquoise green or something i'm not good i'm not that good with colors so yeah one thing i like about burundian streets guys you can see right down here we got they call it uh, pave i don't know how they call it in english it's a road built with stones if you know the name please drop a comment in the comment section of how we call these roads they are made with stones so guys <laughs> i have to tell you i've been walking for a while i'm beginning to sweat one thing you have to know actually guys is burundi is really hot for those who are in kenya when you go kenya pale mombasa where they are Burundi kama 
especially Bujumbura ni kama tu ya Mombasa. Yeah, in Swahili I'm saying the weather in Bujumbura is the same as the weather in Bombasa in Kenya. It's hot and humid actually. Very hot and humid. Guys, I know you guys maybe want to see my f the face behind the voice, but I want to see you there. I want you to see the view actually. The view is amazing, guys. It's really Let's amazing. See the property over here. Quite an amazing property. And the view is amazing, bro. Really very amazing. The view around here is amazing. So guys, I'm going to have to stop recording because of policemen ahead of me and I don't want to get in trouble. So see you after them. Yeah, sorry guys for that. I had to stop recording because uh, policemen over here sometimes they can be annoying when they see you filming they like uh, start telling you that they're gonna find you or something like that so I don't want trouble man <laughs> I just arrived in this country for those who are just tuning in I'm in Bujumbura Burundi the capital city of Burundi to my opinion this is one of most underrated countries in East Africa man look at this I mean, look at these properties. People are building here like there is no tomorrow, man. It's amazing, really. And the architecture is, is really good, actually. This is uh, like a medium rich place for, it's a, like a middle class for people to rent and live here in Bujumbura. It's where middle incomers come to hide, guys. So it's amazing. I like the view. I like how Burundi is actually flat. No, not really the whole of Burundi, but Bujumbura is really pretty uh, flat. So guys, over there, let me just take a left walk a little bit on my left and then uh, we're gonna see where this takes us guys I'm already panting really hard I'm already panting really guys because I'm so tired man it's hot I've been walking for a while and it's pretty hot around here so let me show you the amazing view guys as much as I want you to, to be seen on the camera the view is just amazing so you can see there is a pretty much amazing villas over here people are building and building like there is no tomorrow look at that guys that is amazing I don't know how much that costs in Burundian money because uh, quite an amazing view guys and I think I'm gonna take this right right here let me take this right look at that man I don't know how they call that tree that tree over there I don't know how they call it the next one I'm sure that's a palm tree but these tall ones I don't know how they call them. If you know how they are called, please drop a comment on the comment section and tell us how they are called. But they are really amazing, beautiful, really beautiful trees here over here. So guys, I'm taking a walk in Kinindo. Kinindo, look at what I was saying guys. See how they mark? Every house has got an address, every street has got a number, so it's not easy for you to be lost around here. It's an amazing view. Pretty amazing. Look at this house around me. It's, it's not really quite 
a big mansion but it's a small mansion it and if you ask me this house is enough for a family of probably three or four kids pretty amazing you can see for yourself it's it's an amazing property over here we got another amazing property on my left very very amazing properties look at the view guys and I don't know if you can feel it one thing I like about Burundi is that even though it's hot Burundi is windy the wind comes from the lake Tanganyika Lake Tanganyika is actually one of the deepest not the deepest actually the deepest lake in Africa and I'm telling you that lake looks like this there is no difference the only difference is when you swim in it it has fresh water instead of salty water so that's the only pro difference to me but it's really amazing most lakes look uh, silver black or something lake tanganyika has got crystal blue and greenish water so it's amazing it's really an amazing lake so guys look at this property it's pretty awesome very awesome so it's amazing to be in the streets of Ubura. so guys comment on this video drop a like on this video and guys most of my viewers 90% of my viewers are not subscribed if you know you're not subscribed guys just uh, hit the subscribe button and get me to 1000 help me on this journey on my youtube journey be part of it man it costs nothing actually to subscribe and uh, it doesn't echo actually so support me support this channel uh, hit subscribe look at how amazing Burundi is man pretty amazing look at the view around me oh my I wish you guys could see what I'm seeing on my left by myself on my left actually so guys amazing super amazing the view is amazing man look at these trees bro look at this <laughs> it's like uh, they are giving you a god of honor over here the trees are amazing I like the setup it's actually calm and peaceful to live in this neighborhood it's amazing guys I would love to own a property around here one day so guys one thing I have to tell you is uh, the, all the properties you see here in Burundi they are not actually built or bought with mortgage people build and buy with cash around here so in Africa is pretty much the same actually very many people you find building their houses or buying their houses is they buy with cam. They they all buy with cash actually. So 
nobody here buys by mortgage guys so let nobody fool you that Africa is poor actually Africans are not poor man we just got messed up governments who do not care about their citizens so Africans are not poor Africans are smart Africans are hard-working people because to be able to own such properties by cash guys nobody is having any loans or debt on their properties everybody built bought by cash so it's amazing actually so you have to note that when you come to Africa when you have or want to build or buy land or own a property most of the time it's done with cash so guys thank you for watching I think I'm gonna end uh, this video around here thank you for watching please remember to subscribe like the video share and comment give me your support guys so that I can keep on bringing you more comment regards peace